Brianna? Yeah, Mary Alice, Governor Murphy shut down that contentious debate surrounding the misclassification of workers in New Jersey, today signing a sweeping six-bill package updating the state's labor laws and expanding the definition of who's an employee versus an independent contractor. Sponsors of the legislation say it'll fight back against employers exploiting gig workers by paying them less. The law mandates certain benefits, overtime, and a proper minimum wage. Some independent contractors like freelancers say it could keep them from finding work, reduce their income, and potentially force them out of the state. Markets are closed today, but Wall Street continues seeing dollar signs. Google parent company Alphabet is now the fourth U.S. company to reach a $1 trillion market valuation, pushing the total value of the five biggest tech companies to a record $5 trillion. Alphabet joins the ranks of Apple, Microsoft, and Facebook. Amazon was in their company, but recently sank just below the trillion-dollar threshold. The valuations come as some governments are calling to break up big tech in the wake of heightened regulatory scrutiny concerning data privacy. Consumer spending ended the year on a strong note. U.S. retail sales increased for the third straight month in December, up three-tenths of a percent. November data was revised up to the same gains. The Commerce Department says households were buying more in all major categories except cars. Overall, sales were nearly 6 percent higher compared to last December, and economists say that could bolster the view that the economy maintained a moderate growth pace at the end of 2019. So New Yorkers love to poke fun at bridge and tunnelers from this side of the river, but it turns out the grass may actually be greener in the Garden State. A nationwide survey by Storage Cafe shows New Yorkers are moving here in droves. Nearly 65,000 moved in during 2018, and that was roughly 41 percent of the total incoming population for the year. Now, according to the self-storage search platform, it's not all rosy here. We still lost more than 231,000 residents during the same time period. The leading destination was our other next-door neighbor, Pennsylvania, where the taxes, rent, and gas are all cheaper. And those are your top business stories.